Hey there guys, so this is going to be my very first tutorial video ever made, so please bear with me if I make a lot of mistakes or if I don't explain things correctly. I hope to grow this channel by just giving a real world experience of a developer talking to somebody who is interested in learning. So today's video is going to be about uh, creating an authentication for Laravel that includes an administrator middleware that allows us to restrict access to certain routes inside of Laravel based on whether or not a user is an administrator. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, as you can see, I've already got uh, two windows open. I have my finder with tutorials. I have my command prompt with tutorials as well. So let's just go ahead and create a new Laravel project called Laravel New uh, Auth um, Tutorial. We'll just do that, Auth Tutorial. And we'll hit enter. It'll go ahead and uh, craft this application for us. And while it's doing that, I just want to make sure everything else is open and good to go. And let's see here. Awesome. And we are good to go. Awesome. So, uh, as always, we want to make sure that we have a database uh, to go ahead and use. I'm using SQL Pro in order to uh, control my database and give me a nice GUI uh, to look at my database. So let's just go ahead and add a database and just type in auth tutorial. It would be nice if I could spell today. And hit add. Awesome. So that is uh, good to go. And we'll go ahead and go here. And we'll clear this out a little bit. Uh, I just hit Command K in order to clear it out. And then we will go to PHP Artisan Serve. And we will not run this command just yet because we have not set up our uh, .env file for um, our uh, for our website. So we want to make sure that that is uh, configured before we go ahead and hit that serve command. Um, so we'll go ahead and type in uh, Sublime and we will open up uh, Sublime. Actually, that was bad. I shouldn't have done PHP Artisan Serve there. First we have to CD into Auth Tutorials or Auth Tutorial. <clears throat> and we'll also CD into Auth Tutorial here as well. And now we will open up Sublime and here is our project. Wonderful. So first thing that we're going to do is uh, PHP Artisan uh, make auth and this will go ahead and generate the scaffolding for us uh, automatically for all of the authentication routes. We will go into our .env file. Uh, we'll change our URL to localhost port 8000. Uh, do not add the slash at the end. Um, the reason being is because that slash is automatically added um, and then you'll be going to localhost port 8000 slash slash. Um, so that doesn't really make any sense. Um, we will use the auth tutorial uh, database. We'll go ahead and do root and this is going to be my password. And uh, everything else is good to go there. We will save that, close that out. And we will go over to our auth tutorial uh, and we'll serve that up. And wonderful. Now our site is good to go. Wonderful. So let's just go ahead and register our user really quick. Um, we'll just do Jonathan and we'll do just test at gmail.com and we'll just do a simple password one, two, three, four, five, six. And we'll go ahead and uh, register that. Uh, now, as you can see, uh, auth tutorial.users does not exist. And I did this on purpose because we want to go ahead and create the migration, but we want to edit the existing migration. Uh, we want to add a role that the user can have, whether it's administrator or whether it is, uh, you know, a user or a publisher or an editor or whatever other role you want to go ahead and do. So we can find our migrations in database migrations and create users. 
So we will go ahead and create a new field in our database and we will set it to a string and we will just call it a role. And we will go ahead and save that and we will go ahead and run our migrations. PHP artisan migrate and we'll go ahead and add the step flag at the end. Um, that way we can um, roll back just a single uh, a single migration at a time rather than both the create users and create password uh, resets tables. So we'll just go ahead and uh, add that step flag on there. Hit enter. Wonderful. Now it is there. And uh, actually, you know what? I did something wrong already. Now we'll go ahead and PHP artisan migrate uh, fresh and we will go back to our create users and I forgot to make this nullable. Um, and nullable means you can just go ahead and have a null field inside of that, uh, or a null field inside that uh, that column. So migrate fresh, boom, wonderful, there it is all good to go. Now we will go ahead and refresh our page and continue on and it will go ahead and create our user for us. Um, so that's um, all we're really going to do uh, in order to get us set up on this video. Uh, the next video will go in and create a brand new uh, route um, and we'll just call that admin dashboard and we will uh, then create our middleware uh, to prevent the uh, the user uh, that is logged in uh, that is not an administrator uh, from accessing that account. Uh, so thanks and stay tuned.